Have you ever played Uncharted, Fatima? I haven't, but we have Sydney and Emily here to talk about the video game franchise, live action franchise, film adaptation. Take it away, y'all. Hey, sneak peekers. We had the opportunity to see an early screening of Uncharted starring our favorite Tom Holland. Now we are bringing you all our thoughts on the movie. Released February 18th, 2022, Uncharted is an almost prequel to the popular video game series of the same name. The game was first released in 2007 and gained a massive fan base. Currently, it is a series of four games, all following Nathan Drake on his action-packed journeys. The movie gives viewers the backstory of Nate and what led to his interest in treasure hunting. The film follows the story of Tom Holland as Nathan Drake, a young and bartender turned treasure hunter. Though we are first formally introduced to Drake in New York, we don't stay there long. The story sends us across the globe and he is recruited to join the hunt of discovering Ferdinand Magellan's hidden gold. Fighting bad guys, long journeys, love and loss, the film is everything you'd expect from a classic treasure hunt. The movie begins immediately propelling us into action. The editing style and shot choices added characteristics that made you feel like you were playing as Nathan Drake, truly playing homage to the game. Throughout the movie, these choices became a theme, whether it be shots set up in first person, allowing the viewers to see only the hands of Drake, or a character yelling commands, we truly felt like we were in the movie. For video game fans, especially those of Uncharted, this is a really exciting and interesting addition. Though I tend to lean more towards rom-coms, I was fully invested and enjoyed the film. The multiple shots of Tom Holland's shirtless may or may not have kept me Agreed. <laughs> um, I found the film actually really funny, which I was not expecting. While it definitely had some predictable treasure hunt cliches, they were equally balanced by jaw-dropping twists and turns that left us wanting more. While neither of us are original fans of the video game, we didn't feel left out of the loop at all. Though they may, there may have been some references for diehard fans and a great cameo to look out for, it did not keep us from enjoying the movie. Overall, Uncharted was a classic action-adventure film that reminded me what I loved about the movie theater experience. It's funny, lighthearted, and has something for every age. And in true Sony fashion, we were left with a little surprise at the end. All we have to say is, don't be too eager to hop out of that seat when the credits start rolling. That's all from us, but be sure to tweet us your thoughts on all things Uncharted at Sneak Peek TV. Now, back to the hosts. What a great review, I have to say. I'm a little bit excited about the movie now, especially after hearing that Tom takes his shirt off. <laughs> Me too. Maybe I'll even look into the game as well. 